North Melbourne and GWS Giants both look to be ready for this enticing matchup. Anthony Hudson with you as we prepare for this one. Welcome to University of Tasmania Stadium. And with me is Melbourne great Gary Lyon. Thanks, hello. It's great to be here. Today's big game is between North Melbourne and the Giants. They run on in full confidence. They're looking sharp and the crowd are appreciating it. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. It's a big day for GWS Giants forwards. If they can get on top of the North Melbourne defence, they'll go a long way to winning the game. North Melbourne are coming down the race. They look ready and rearing, and the crowd are right behind them. The banners look great as the players get set to run through them. North Melbourne is the team that plays to win for you and me. The captains make their way to the middle for the toss. North Melbourne wins the toss. Well, we all know who should get the job done, but its shaping is a very interesting matchup. Just waiting for the opening siren now. And here we go, it's North Melbourne taking on GWS Giants. Allen slips the tackler, wins herself a free for that tackle. Didn't get away from that tackle. Great tackling there, Hutto. Carney will have to put everything into this one. She heads for home. Long kick there. Will it go all the way? It does. That's her first. Look at her. She really enjoyed that one. North Melbourne draw first blood. Won the hit out. She gets her hands on the footy. Coughed up by Garner. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Towards centre half forward. Good mark by Riddle. Opportunity once again for North Melbourne to put one through. Going for goal number one. Through for a minor score. North Melbourne by seven points. Ready to bring it back into play. Winning the ball in the air was Schmidt. She spears the ball. McKinnon got it high there. A chance here to convert for North Melbourne. Garner to have the shot from outside 50. Bit of an angle for this kick. Going for goal number one. It's a huge kick and it goes all the way. Garner couldn't be happier with that goal. Now they lead by 13. Back in the middle. Slapped away. The ball's knocked loose. Del Pass dishes it off. Staunton wins the marking contest. A chance for Schmidt. Cleanly picked up. Just put her hands in the back of the opponent. And it's a free. Move it on. Uses it by foot. The umpire pings her here. Kick by Green. Nice hands. Works the ball out of the 50. Takes a strong mark. Wants to go. Just gave it away. Brutton links with a teammate who can run. Three picks it up. Chose to kick it. Bonner picks up the loose ball. Penetrating handball. Goes back to Tully. Dishes it off to a player on the run. Going for goal number one. No problems with that kick from Eva. 
Smiles all round. GWS Giants get themselves on the board. Some great ball movement there. And just knew they were going to score. We're back in motion. North Melbourne have failed to get on top of the clearance, but it's how they can turn the ball over that is allowing them to score. Staunton has a teammate on the move. Green goes off the ground. Snaffle that bike rush. She just throws that ball. King goes with the kick. Gibson takes a strong mark. North Melbourne fans would love to see this one sail through. 50 metres from home. She heads for home. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Distance, no problems from here. Move it on. Going for goal number one. Go Abitangelo loves that goal. North Melbourne by 13. This is how they can score, Big Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. It's great to watch Hutto. Plenty of excitement. The game is back underway. One down. Carney grabbed it clean. The handball now from Gillespie Jones. Great mark. The kick from Eason. A chance to reload the attack now. Kicks inside the 50. Gibson has it. Move it on. Going for goal number one. The Ruse fans getting excited about that one. She's really enjoying that goal. North Melbourne have kicked the last two goals. 19 points the difference. She's got the footy in her hands. Kicks hurriedly. A strong mark in the pack from Gibson. 40 metres out. Looking to kick goal number two. It's a poor kick and it hits the behind post. Kicked it straight into the behind post. Goes with the kick. High tackle. A chance to put one through here for North Melbourne. 45 metres out. Ashmore unloads one towards goal. He sums up the situation and delivers. Of course, Hutter. Gets her first, celebrating hard. The margin is 25. We're back in the middle to resume play. One it down. Takes possession. Great mark under pressure. Wants to play on. This is Trent. Just gets it onto the boot. Carney couldn't keep her hands on it. Randall moves it now. Gets the loose ball. Brutton steers it towards goals. Picks up the loose ball. Abitangelo breaks the tackle. Runs it over the boundary line. The umpire will throw it back in. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game's going right now. Gives the old don't argue. Bateman can't hold on to the tackle. Gillespie Jones puts it on the boot. Umpire not fooled by that effort. Pays the free kick. McKinnon tucks it into the pocket. Rush gets on the end of this. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. North Melbourne forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. It's a turnover. Pushes off the tackler. Looks up with the... As we go into the break, the scores are North Melbourne, 31, GWS Giants, 6. North Melbourne started well. Now it's time for them to do it for four quarters. The game was fairly open for the first quarter with plenty of goals to be had. Time to take a look at the stats. 
GWS Giants are struggling to maintain the pace of the game. They might need to slow it down and take some uncontested marks to get the game back on their terms. Thank you, Gaz. Players ready to start the second quarter. Back in the middle as the Rucks go at it. Gillespie Jones won the hit out. She's got the football now. All kinds of pressure being applied. Great tackle. Ball stripped in the tackle. Going for goal number two. That's the sort of goal that can get the team up and about. Ashmore puts them further in front. She celebrates hard after that. Umpire ready to resume play. Thrashes it. Ashmore applies a bump. Shows some physicality. Parker gurns a free kick. Puts boot to ball. She gives chase to the footy. Had the pressure bearing down. Manages to get it onto the boot. Green dug out the loose ball. Staunton sees off Duffin. Doesn't take the mark. A bit too hard with a push. And it's a free kick. Moved on by Allen. Can't take the mark. Stevenson goes for it now. Intercepts the ball well. Moves the ball by foot. The loose ball picked up. Hardiman making her way onto the field. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? This game needs a spark at the moment. It'll be a ball up. McKinnon clears the contest. Thumps it clear. She gets her hands on the footy. And the umpire will ball it up. Swats it. Carney soccers a kick. Hardiman gathers it now with quick hands. The handball hits the target. Trent clears the ball from the contest. Takes that one strongly. Slams it on the boot. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Links with hands. Goes by hand to Tully. Had plenty of the ball. Got the hands free. Nacro now. Stuck the bits out there and held on to it. Chips it towards half forward. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Sinks the slipper into it. A race for the loose ball. The tackle over the shoulder. Bateman flicks it over. Hits the target by hand. She has the ball. She can take off after that handball. Dal Pass now heading off to the bench for a break. We'll get a ball up on the wing. Winning it was McKinnon. Gibson short by hand. Rutten continues to find the ball. She's been superb today, Hutto. She just throws that ball. A low stabbing kick. Gets into a good position to take that. Beeson spears the ball. She takes the mark. Bar wants to play on. Strong mark in the contest. Dishes it off. Up for grabs for Grierson. At full stride, receives the handball with a driving kick. Marks all alone. Lining up for goal. 20 metres out, lining up from a 45-degree angle. Abitangelo going for number two. North Melbourne doing well at the moment. Randall plays on. Almost cut it off. The loose ball scooped up. And she's stepped over the boundary line. We'll get a throw in here. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? This game needs a spark at the moment. Lobs the handball. Hardiman going for number one. What a goal! This one gives them a bigger lead. She acknowledges the crowd. North Melbourne lead is now 38. We're back in motion. Wins the ruck duel. Is in her possession. Big tackle! McKinnon collects the loose ball. Scoops up the ball. Doing well was Schmidt. You've just got to do better there. GWS Giants reduce the margin. Marking in space was Grierson. 
Chose to kick it. Good mark there. Randall drives the kick. Marked by Bennett. Ops to play on. Elects to kick. Gets a quick kick away. This kick to keep some hope alive. A bad finish results in the behind. GWS Giants produce the margin. Takes a simple grab. Brutton elects to kick. A strong pack mark. Trend uses it by foot. Riddle spills it. Hardiman sends it clear of the contest. Spills the mark. Dug out the loose ball. Decides to kick. The mark has been taken. Garner plays on. Kick goes astray and it's out on the full. Slams it on the boot. Now we'll get a ball up. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? I'd really love it if these teams took the contest to the next level. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Slapped away. Found a way through. Stevenson on the ball. The mark is taken by Sreka. North Melbourne haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Ball up in the centre square. Tap came from Garner. Gathered by Sreka. Needs a bit of a rest. Bar just put it on the boot. Finds a target. Moves the ball by foot. A good second term. See the scores. North Melbourne, 44. And GWS Giants, 8. North Melbourne will go into the rooms at halftime with plenty of confidence and back themselves for the second half. Let's analyse the stats. It's quite simple. North Melbourne won more of the ball and have been able to create more opportunities in front of goal. Thank you very much, Gaz. We're halfway through this match and there's plenty more footy to come in the second half. Ready to begin proceedings in the second half. Gillespie Jones won the tap. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Gillespie Jones got in the better position. Showing some really good pressure there. The ball ends up with Bennett. Chips it towards half forward. Bit of a harsh call, but the umpire saw it as deliberate. Alex to kick it long. Brutton has had plenty of it, Gaz. Yes, I know. She's a class act. Ball gets cut off, manufactures the handball. Practicing some fancy moves, and the mark will be paid. Looks to move it by foot. Duffin collects the loose ball. Goes by foot. Spent that one before she earned it. King not getting much of it, Gaz. That's right, Hutto. She just can't seem to get into the game. North Melbourne have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. So what could North Melbourne do with this opportunity in front of goal? Going for goal number one. It was always pushing that post and pushing so hard it's hit it. North Melbourne by 37. Randall to bring it back into play. A big contested grab. Now with a low spearing kick. Collects the loose ball. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm waiting for something to change the way this game's going right now. North Melbourne needs to be more aware of the opposition set up at the stoppage. Their hitouts are getting cut off too easily. Uses it now. Bennett collects it with the ball now. Works it across the ground. It's marked by Garner. Goes with the kick. Right, gets in a good position. Puts it on the boot. Couldn't snaffle it. Carney has a chance to put a second goal on the board. She went for broke from a long way, and it paid off. This kick stretches the lead. She's excited about that one. Center bounce. Guides it down. Bonner finds possession. Slips the tackle. 
Doing well to intercept that kick. North Melbourne, they're allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Well collected. We'll get a ball up on the wing. King put it down. Bonner struggling to run at the moment. An easy grab for Freaker. North Melbourne just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Uses it by foot. Over the top of the pack. Schmidt with a chance, if she can keep her cool. 25 metres out. Going for goal number one. Goal! She loved that one. GWS Giants close the gap to 37. King won it. She gains the possession. A good mark under the circumstances. Riddle pops to play on, puts boot to ball, takes the mark. A 45 degree angle for this shot at goal. Bateman going for number one. Ends up turning this ball over. Tries to gain some territory. Stuck the mitts out there and held on to it. Sinks the slipper into it. A great mark taken there. Got boot to ball. Landed at her back on this occasion. Looks up with a kick. Riddle quickly onto the boot. Gibson continues to dominate this contest. She's the most dominant player on the ground at the moment. Going for goal number one. And the chance at goal is taken by North Melbourne. They get around her after that effort. The lead is now 43. It's great to watch her. Though. Plenty of excitement. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. GWS Giants need to find the ball more. If they can get their hands on the ball, then they can start to create some chances. Gibson kicks it. Easily takes the mark. Green looks to build some momentum with this kick. A spearing kick. Humphreys with an easy mark. An ideal position to be kicking from. Move it on. Going for goal number one. Just sneaks in from behind. North Melbourne lead by 44. Randall players move as they look to provide an option. With a driving kick, marks in a bit of space. Moves it by foot. Good mark there. Elects to kick. She seems to be struggling at this stage. It might be time for a break. Over the top of the pack. Looks to move it by foot. Flew high but didn't hold on. Ball up in the centre square. It's just a bit lacklustre out there for my liking. Parker onto the ball. Has it now. She has the ball. Open opportunity for Bar. GWS Giants would love to make the most of this opportunity. At the end of three quarters, it's North Melbourne 58, GWS Giants 14. North Melbourne walk into three-quarter time with the lead and the confidence they can win this game. What stands out for you, Gas? GWS Giants are creating plenty of chances from turnover. They just need to generate that into more scoring opportunities to be a big chance. Thanks, Gary.
We have one quarter of footy ahead of us. Let's go. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Hacking it out of there. Ashmore found a way to mark that one. Tips it towards half forward. A mark by Bateman. With a driving kick. Allen got up, but couldn't bring it down. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Yeah, she's having a quiet match, Hutto. Bar just threw it. If they just maintain position and hold onto the ball for a moment, they should be able to hold on here. Carney wax one on the boot for goal. Started the kick wide, and it never came back. Now they lead by 45. Looking for options now. Randall plays it to herself. Goes with the kick. Rush takes the mark. Uncontested. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. Putting this one through would give off Melbourne. Plenty of confidence. 30 metres out. Bateman going for number one. Just hits the post and a minus score. 46 points the difference. Considering the options on the kick in. Finds a target. North Melbourne haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning total that way. Off hands from Stevenson. King with the intercept. Randall unable to hold on. Mason didn't mark it. This game is out of hand and could go downhill even further. Receives the handball and takes off. So close, but just misses. Now they lead by 47. Searching for a teammate. Doing well with the mark. Goes by foot. Del Pass controlling the airwaves on this occasion. It's a foot race to get this one. Puts on a big hit. She gets her hands on the footy. Bennett has the ball. No issues with that drop punt. They kick the goal to stem the flow. Are we about to see a shift in this game? Look at them celebrate that effort. About to resume play. Won the hit out. Gets on the end of this. The loose ball scooped up. Takes possession. Gathers it now. Carney hacking it out of there. Tully drops the mark. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Yeah, she's barely touched the ball, Hunter. Great attack on the ball carrier. A big contested grab. Moves it by foot. Takes the mark all by herself. And the mark will be paid. 35 metres out. Should be simple from here. Massive kick here. They need to convert this opportunity. Pretty happy with that one. GWS Giants now only trailed by 35. Back in the middle. Tap down. She gains the possession. Carney releases the ball. A quick handball from Staunton. This is kickable by her standards. Normally a good shot on goal. Schmidt moves it now. Finds this one all by herself. Takes a few deep breaths before this important kick. 25 metres out. Should be relatively straightforward from here. Moving on. Bennett might kick a goal. Just a minor. They'll have to really roll the dice here to have any chance. North Melbourne have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. It's why they're still in front. Gives away a free for in the back. Looks up with a kick. They chase after the loose ball. Movement by hand. Fighting hard was King. Duffin comes away with the ball. Picked up by Wright. Slick with the hands. She's got the footy in her hands. Quickly onto the boot. Hits the post, and it's a behind. The margin is 35. Deciding where to go with the kick in. And now we'll have a ball up. 
What can you tell us, Gaz? I'd love for the coach to send a message out there and tell these players to take the game on. Fantastic pressure there. Opportunity for King. Marks now and can send it back. Finds this and marks well. Got boot to ball. Takes a nice mark. 45 metres out. Moving on. Going for goal number one. Bateman manages to get it over the line and through for a goal. This kick has extended their lead. Gets some reward for her efforts. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. North Melbourne are getting themselves into the right spots at the moment. They're cutting off these opposition kicks. Staunton gives it off, and now they go. Is in her possession. She pops through the goal. That's her second. Congratulated by her teammates. GWS Giants behind by 35. North Melbourne are getting beaten at the coalface. They need to rectify these clearance numbers to give themselves the best chance going forward. Takes the mark all by herself. Good opportunity for GWS Giants to put a goal through here. She decides to go for home. That's a well-executed kick for a goal. She's enjoying every second of it out there. Puts it through. Can that goal be the start of something more? Puts it through. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. A great bit of play that resulted in that goal. GWS Giants needs to do a better job and gain more clearances at the moment. They're getting beaten in the contest and it's affecting the scoreboard. Riddle leaps over the top. Moves the ball by foot. Collected by Tran. Keeps it moving. Has it now. Takes that one strongly. A 45 degree angle for this shot at goal. Abitancello looking to put through another goal. She's excited about that one. North Melbourne really starting to dominate. North Melbourne need to be far more competitive with their clearance work. They can't win games that way. Not the most exciting match, but the fans of the winning side will feel pretty good right about now. What stood out for you today, Gary? They have to learn from this experience. People will start asking questions of GWS Giants if they continue to play like they did today. Final scores at 11, 8, 74 to 6, 3, 39. That's all for today. On behalf of myself and Gary Lyon, thanks for joining us. We'll see you again soon. It's been my pleasure, Hutto, and we look forward to having everyone back soon. And sing it one and all. Join in the chorus. North Melbourne's on the wall. Good old North Melbourne. They're champions, you'll agree. North Melbourne is the team that plays to win for you.